In this video, we will cover the unpacking of the printer. Please remember that the printer should be unpacked and moved by two people. At first, remove the entire stretch foil and the other shipping protections. Always remember to be cautious and protected while handling the sharp tools so don't damage the printer, yourself or anyone around you. Now, cut the tightening belts. To do it, use a knife or a scissors. Now, pull up the top lid and put it aside. Here, we can see the first protection foam of a crystal guide. That will come handy in the next steps. Let's put the top foam aside. Now, I need to take care of the cardboard around the printer. The cardboard can be opened along the front right corner. To open it, I need to gently unhook two holding hooks. Now you can lift the cardboard. After removing the protection cardboard, now we can finally see the entire printer. Right now, the printer is still protected by the foam corners. One additional thing that we can also see here are the carrying straps. This red velcro band holds everything in place. Let's unfasten the red velcro band to remove the foams and release the carrying straps. Now is the moment when someone will need to give us a hand. You and your partner should stand on the sides of the printer. Grab the carrying straps and put your forearms to one set of the sleeves. Choose the sleeve position depending on your height to make the carrying safe and comfortable. Please remember to keep the carrying straps. They might come in handy in the future. The printer needs to be installed in the proper place where first, the surface is flat and stable. Second, if you place it on some kind of table, make sure it can hold at least 80 kilograms. Third, there is a minimum 200 mm of space from the left and the right side of the printer for proper ventilation and easy access to the filtration system in case of replacement. And fourth, there is enough space above the printer to open the top door, which is 260 mm. Now, let's take a look on the components that we can see right after unpacking the printer. We can distinguish few important elements while looking at the front of the printer. From the top, we have a top door which operator of the machine can use for extruder maintenance. The front door to reach the inside of the printer and perform all necessary operations. A USB slot for flash drive with files. At the bottom of the printer there is a material station. Here we'll put the spools of the currently used materials. On the right side we have a slot for G4 input air filtration and on the left side there is a slot for HEPA carbon output air filtration. At the back of the printer, there is a power button, power socket, USB slot for the Wi-Fi module, and Ethernet slot. After you put the machine in its final place, it is good to make sure that the printer is leveled by adjusting the leveling legs. All is left is to connect the printer directly to the rounded wall outlet. 